All right, Devin Carter, 2008, 103 pound Virginia State champ. You were runner up at the Ironman, runner up at the Beast of the East, and runner up at the Power Age. Yep. Okay, what are we gonna do, what are you gonna do, to get you into the top position, let's say at the Ironman this year? Well, last year I was all, you know, kind of afraid that I wasn't sure if I could hang with all the toughest kids. But, you know, I realized last year that I was right up there with them, so I can just step it up and I can go out there confident and work just as hard as everybody else out there. What did you do this summer? Okay, you knew you could hang with those guys. You were second at, you know, three of the top five tournaments in the country. What did you do this summer to go from two to one in all those tournaments? Pretty much just, you know, work. I had to work on my little technical things, you know, just improve on that. And, you know, just listen to the coaches and just staying after, doing extra stuff and everything. That's pretty much it. Fargo? What about Fargo? Did you go? Yeah, I got seventh in Greco and I choked in freestyle. Lost my first match to uh, seventh in Silver. junior or cadet? A uh, cadet. Seventh in cadet free. Uh, cadet 112. 112, which was a loaded weight. Yeah. I think Thilke might have won that weight. He won in Greco, not in freestyle. Okay. So you, you, know, you had a loaded weight in Greco, you're an All-American. Yeah. So that's a part of it, you know, that training camp, going out there, that experience. Yep. Okay, what would you say the goals are for Christianburg, Tr Christiansburg Blue Demons this year? Just got to build the base. We, um, we lost a lot of kids last year to move out and graduates. And we just got to have our middle schoolers working harder and harder every day. I mean, they're actually stepping up and buying into everything that the coach is saying, so they're actually starting to improve now. So we just got to make get our younger kids ready so it can like be better for future years. Okay, you live within five minutes of Virginia Tech. Yeah. Do you feel pretty confident that you might want to stay home at this point, or are you still looking? I don't know. I haven't been living in Virginia that long, so it's kind of home to me, kind of not. I mean. I'm thinking about going to Tech, but there's also a lot of places out there, and I want to be a vet, which Tech has a good vet place, but there's other places, so I just got to see what happens in the next few years. Don't want to limit your options. Yeah. Especially All right, Devin. So early. Is there anything else you want people to know about Devin Carter and the Blue, Do Blue Demons? Not really. Not, not really? Not really. Not really. Did you, go, did, you, uh, did you ever end up going on uh, MySpace today after the run? I did. Facebook gonna, too? Uh, yeah. I'm gonna, I actually went on my phone onto MySpace. You did? <laughs> yep. After I even said it to you? Yep. All right. Teenagers aren't too hard to predict. And Devin, good luck this year, and we'll see you at the Ironman. Thank you.